Do you think you could live in a shopping mall for two years? This is a little bit what it was like for eight people when they entered Biosphere 2 for a two-year mission. Their goal was to live sealed inside a self-sustaining dome for two years. They would not be provided any outside food, water, or oxygen, and live off the plants and animals they would raise inside the biosphere. Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science and Biosphere 2. I recently visited my sister who lives in Oracle, Arizona. After arriving, my sister mentioned we should go visit Biosphere 2. My reply was, sounds good, but what is Biosphere 2? In the late 80s and early 90s, the world was excited about building colonies in space. Many people thought that in their lifetime, a space colony may be built on Mars. A group of people led by John Allen and financed by Ed Bass set out to build a self-contained module here on Earth that eight people would live in for two years and be fully supported. Biosphere 2 is located right outside of Oracle, Arizona. It looks out over the Catalina Mountains of Arizona. The people who would live inside Biosphere 2 would grow all their food, recycle their water, rely on their plants for oxygen, and also carry out some experiments. Biosphere 2 had a rainforest, a savanna, a desert, an ocean with a coral reef, mangrove wetlands, and an agricultural system. Before the Biospherian could enter the biosphere, plants and animals had to be gathered from all around the world and then transported and grown inside. This was no easy task. Finally, on September 26, 1991, Eight Biospherians entered Biosphere 2. Each person had their own small apartment, and there was a communal kitchen. Now, what did they eat? The agricultural system produced 83% of their total diet. They had bananas, sweet potatoes, peanuts, beans, of course rice, and some wheat. And during the first year, the eight inhabitants reported hunger all the time. But in spite of their hunger, their medical markers indicated that they were in excellent health. In addition to the agriculture, the crew had goats, chicken, and fish. In the end, they ended up losing 25% of their body weight. However, the biggest problem the crew faced was inadequate oxygen and spiking CO2 levels. The lack of oxygen created an environment that simulated living at 13,000 feet. This lack of oxygen and also the calorie-restricted diet contributed to low morale, a.k.a. they were grumpy all the time. Well, maybe not grumpy, but how would you be if you didn't get to eat much and there was not any oxygen? However, in the end, the mission of Biosphere 2 was both a success and a failure. The crew learned how to live together for two years in an unsupported environment, but at one point oxygen had to be pumped into Biosphere 2 to help the crew. Eventually, there was another shorter mission, but then the goal of Biosphere 2 changed to more of a research facility. Guys, I highly recommend visiting Biosphere 2 if you live in the Tucson area or need an excuse to go to Arizona. I really enjoyed it. And remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today. Thanks.